Hello guys and welcome to every time I die in Minecraft then I do many exercises. I have two wheels and two tabs and the first one gives me the number of items I need to do the activity and the other one tells me which exercise I have to do. If I ever die in hard mode in Minecraft then I have to spin both wheels and do the exact exercise it lands on. Alright so the world has just loaded and I have it on hard mode so I do take damage in this. I might as well start off by grabbing some wood so I can craft tools and many other things. Okay, first thing real simple, craft some spruce planks and then craft a crafting table and some sticks. And then we can go ahead and craft our first tool, which is gonna be a wooden pickaxe. I see some stone. Let's start mining it. I'm gonna get enough stone for all the tools that I need and I'll also get enough stone for my furnace, which I will use later. I'm not actually gonna calculate the amount of stone I need, I'm just gonna mine until I feel like I'll have enough. 21, is that enough? I don't know, let's just go see. So now that we're back up here, let's make a better pickaxe, stone pickaxe. Let's craft some more sticks, stone axe, and also a stone sword just so we can protect ourselves. The next useful thing that I think we should probably get is like, oh, well, look at that, there's a village. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't see that. But we're gonna go do that now. Whoa, 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 whoa. That could have been very close. Okay, guys, I almost fell into the lava, but thank goodness I didn't. <laughs> Why is there lava over there too? There's so much lava. This is not a very safe place to be in. Let's just hope this village has iron. Let's look in here real quick. Oh, this is actually useful. We can use this to quickly smelt our food. I don't know why I could have just gone through the back. Oh, this is also useful. We can put books in here and that's pretty much it. We might as well also get these books too since we could use them to enchant our tools later once we fight the ender dragon if we do end up fighting the ender dragon okay let's take a bed we'll need that also this oh this is a good iron source we'll get that some armor all right we got some armor it, it helps a lot let's see if we can aggro this iron golem this is very risky I did it. Okay, let's try not to waste our cobblestone here. Iron. Five iron? Whoa. That is very good. Have I been in here yet? No. Okay, might as well use this. Oh, I need food. I completely forgot that I needed food. So I need food. That's the thing that's prominent in like everything. Is that ready? Potato? <gasps> it is ready. Oh, well, look at that. Look at how many trees there are. Right. Pillow bear, polar bear, poly berry. Oh, wait. Did it just do half my, my heart? fish. Oh, look at that. The sun set is uh, doing its thing, so maybe we should sleep. I want a, a base in a mountain. Look at that. It's a pig. And you know what it also means? Food. Yay. Look at that. I think that's a good place to maybe even build like a base there. Like just build it into the side of the wall like I was saying earlier. It's a good idea to build a shield. But hey, look, there's coal. A lot more uh, useful than... There's only one. <laughs> so there's supposed to be like 300, but definitely a good place to get ores like that. So we're gonna try and get over there. I don't know about you, but I'm a little bit greedy for iron. Here we go. <sighs> Fresh iron. See, this is how cool it's supposed to spawn. Just clear that. Oh, is that a skeleton? Oh, it's a skeleton. Gotta build a base really quickly. Okay, well, I'm gonna try sleeping for the night. My right, blue bed, place it down, and we're sleeping just like that. It seems to be the morning now. I think here will be a good place to put my, my other room. All right, I just built this room really quickly. Uh, I don't know how it looks, but first, let's just craft a quick shield so that I can protect myself. I'm gonna craft some chests, which will go right there. I'll also craft a pickaxe for now. I guess I'll just store it in my chest. All right, I got all my stuff cooking in here, but while I'm waiting, I'm actually gonna craft a door. And I'm just gonna place it right here at the front of my base, just like that. We got sand over there. We have red sand for some reason. I'm gonna get this coal first. Food right here. And with this eight iron, I'm going to craft the rest of my tools. All right, this is about all I need. Where's the iron? Is the iron right there? Okay, I see, I see. There's more iron over there. Mine some of this. Seven more iron. I might also want to get the iron over there. Uh oh. All right, let's see how many that I have. Please don't be 100. Oh, 
35. All right, I see. Time to do the whatever this is. No. Squat. Okay. 35 squats. Okay, that's not that's not bad, okay? I'm not going to use my webcam so you guys won't be able to see me actually doing the exercises, but I promise you I am actually doing it. So I'm going to do it right now. Okay. Let's go back to Minecraft, guys. All right, back in Minecraft. Um, cook this iron. I'm gonna go get that iron again. The iron that was on the side down here. Oh, is that actually another portal? I'm going to sleep. Good morning. Here's the morning. It's already bright and day on site, and it took like two seconds for that to happen. Oh, look at that. Put an arrow in my leg. I've noticed that staying up in the hills is a lot better for me, because moms normally don't spawn a peach. No. Get out. Our goal is to get down there. So we're gonna place one block, two block. This is gonna <laughs> prevent me. And then there, we made it without taking any damage whatsoever. Uh, to make it easier for me to be able to get there, I'm gonna craft a shovel really quickly. I might as well also craft armor. I'll make that. What? Why did I do- I'll get the iron again. I have more iron to smelt. Look at me! Why did I craft leggings? Sticks and a shovel. Alright, here we go. Now we have a shovel. And I'm skedaddling. Alright, so we're just gonna mine out all this gravel. Have you guys ever seen gravel being excavated before? All right, so here is a new like kind of renovation to my base. And as you can see, I added a little staircase thing and pillars. And I also made this stairway to go up here uh, since it's a lot easier. That's pretty much all I have, so I'm gonna go sleep. Let's go to the ruined portal because it is useful. Oh, wait. All right, how many do we have to do? Let's hope it's around like 20. Please not 100. Oh, no. Please, 60. <laughs> okay, I'll be fine if it's like jumping jacks. There you go. If it's push ups, I'm not gonna make it. No. Sit ups. Okay. <laughs> let's get back to Minecraft. All right, let's see what's up here. Fire aspect one, sword, golden nuggets, fire charts, flint steel. All this stuff is great, but to be honest, I probably won't really use much of it besides from this block. How do I get to the end? I need to get blaze rods and the nether. By the way, you may, you guys may think I'm lying, but I, I genuinely, I am, I promise to you, I am actually doing it. All I gotta hope is that I do not fall. You know, I rarely ever play Minecraft survival simply because I'm not good at it. Adding this kind of challenge makes it just a lot harder. Uh, <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Here's what I'm gonna do because I don't know how many of you guys know, but it's probably gonna be like impossible for me to beat the Ender Dragon. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give myself a challenge. If I can do the challenge, then I will go to the end and I'll try and beat the Ender Dragon without having to do anything like go to the Nether. Which is why my challenge is gonna be being in the Nether because I do not put cheats on this world. As you can tell, if I try and type in game mode or anything, 3F4, nothing works. So, save and click the title. I'm gonna click new world. So, the challenge is gonna be to be able to get 10 blaze rods in the nether with iron armor and iron gear and everything. If I can do it, then I'll move on to fighting the, the boss battle. If I die, I still have to spin the wheel. Right, let's see what happens. Hopefully, I, I do not forget to bring anything. Gold is what I forgot to bring, but that's okay. Our goal is only finding the nether fortress. So, we gotta get to it as fast as possible. Now the bad thing is I have no idea how to do that. I just switched into survival mode. Well, look at that. Skills. Alright, let's hope that if I don't touch the ping pinglet, p piglins, p pinglet, pit. After that, if I don't touch the younglings, then hopefully I don't get too close to the younglings because I don't want to die or anything. That's like the main goal of the whole thing. Oh, also, I'm just gonna do- I'm, I know I'm doing a lot of stuff that's like maybe cheating, but I just- it's the, literally the only way I will be able to, to win. Uh, back to the spinning board. Oh, only 10? All right, good, good, good. All right, let's see what happens. Spin, spin, spin. Please only give like really easy stuff. Jumping jacks, 10 jumping jacks. Why is that so easy? I fell on lava, it should be a harder punishment. Ten. Ten. Thank you, spinning magic eight ball wheel. I just need to locate the nether fortress. Uh, all right, let's teleport there. Where is it? Wait, wait, you're telling me that the fortress was in the wall? I don't know how I would ever see that. All right, I spawned myself into survival mode, so hopefully none of these piglins attack me. Since all I want to do is go get some blaze runs. I mean, no harm, guys. Don't worry about me. Yeah, guys, I'm friendly. Look at that. 
micro parkour skills. We gotta figure out how to go in there. And that's interesting to say since I literally have a pickaxe. Ah, oh, I see something. Here we are. Right into the middle. Hee <laughs> hee. What? Why did I think that was, such, that was such a good idea? That isn't funny. It's not. Alright, guys. Let's see what happens. Please do not do 100. If it's not 100, I will be very proud of myself. 45. Jumping jacks. Please. Oh. More setups. <laughs> I mean, I'm surprised I haven't never gotten push-ups yet. All right, so I've put myself back in this spot, switched myself to creative mode, gave myself back some tools. Uh, hopefully, I can make it out alive and do what I do best. Look at that, no damage at all. Here's all my old stuff. Wait, should I have done that? Was that a bad idea? Does that make every single other pigman come after me? Hope not, because I won't be able to survive very long. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going. Let's go up here. Oh, is that a blaze spawner? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do like what all those strats do. They like this. I don't exactly know why. There we go. Where are the blazes? Oh, there they are. Come here. Uh, what the? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, this time I'm actually not gonna try and die. Alrighty, let's see this. No. No! <laughs> 90? Please, jumping jacks. I've never gone push-ups before, I swear. If it even decides to land on push-ups, you know, that's okay. Oh my gosh. My legs are gonna be sore tomorrow. Okay, so over here is where I died last time, so... Hey guys, can you spare me, please? I wonder why so many of you guys spawn. No blade draw. Oh. Here we are. 35? 35 jumping jacks. I'm surprised that's not landed on push-ups. Okay. Alright, here we go. I'm sick of dying. I'm so lucky that it did not hit me. What? There you go. Okay, I'm gonna start taking them off whenever I land on them. 30. 30 what? Better not be push-ups. 30 sit-ups. <sighs> I get so much tired out. This is so hard to do. Please, please, please. I survive that? No! Alright. 50. If it's push ups, I'm gonna scream. No! <laughs> no! My arms are sore. My legs are sore. Okay, guys, I'm back in my spot. No, can you not give me one? Please! Ah! Yes! Yes! I got 10! I got 10 blaze rods! Bye bye. I don't want to see you. I'm going to the end. Wait, how do I get back? Don't mind me, guys. It, don't worry about it, okay? Did I spawn in a cave? Are you kidding me? Let me mine my way out of here with my pickaxe. <gasps> Whoa. Yeah, I'm just crafting some ender eyes right now. All right, let's see where it goes. Okay, this way. I'm gonna have fun editing this two hour long recording. Minecraft stronghold. It was 896 blocks away. How could it spawn inside of an iceberg? Hey, look at that. I got it without cheating, obviously. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Instead of having this, I'm gonna make it actually possible. Just all the beds you can get, you know? All right, I think I'm ready. Yeah, yeah. Actually, no, I gotta get a pickaxe. Just to be quicker, I'm gonna do this because I have a feeling that we're gonna spawn inside of the ground. That is gonna be horrible. We did not spawn inside the ground. That is a good looking start. I think I got it. I'm gonna throw the inner pearl over here. Not looking at anyone. Get Look at that. Not looking at you. Stop trying to get in my vision. I don't wanna attack you because you're just gonna hunt me down. I don't have anything to do with you. Oh, look at that, I can get in here. <laughs> here we go. I don't want a hundred of anything. Forty. Better not be push-ups. Forty squats. More squats? I actually did not expect that. If I somehow die of this, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I got that one. Yeah, I got it. Oops. Yeah. Dude. Oh no. Oh my gosh. What? Why is my crossbow not working? Did I run out of- Oh my gosh. Bro. No. Here we go again. 20. 20 setups. 
So instead of beating the game normally, I'm gonna have to beat the game with the most powerful weapon in the game. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually just gonna go and create a mode. It's so crazy. You know what this is? It's the most powerful. No, I'm just kidding. This is not the most powerful in the game. I'm not actually joking. The most powerful weapon in the game is actually the pufferfish. <laughs> you guys did not know um the reason is because I'll, I'll explain it once i get there and a dragon is approaching and all we gotta do is gonna snap with the puffer fish so and just like that guys it's the most powerful weapon in the game that's how you beat the game and yeah there you go guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you subscribed and uh watch my other videos please <laughs>